Hey y'all, I wanted to come and show y'all this candle that I got from Target. This is a viral um candle from TikTok. So it was only $10 made by Threshold. I already opened and tried it out, but I wanted to just come and show you guys in case you're not aware. Anyway, I was hoping that when the candle is done, um, this little small candle, I was hoping that you could remove it, but I don't think you can because this part right here is jelly. So I don't think you can remove it unless you just real, um, I mean, you might be able to, but anyway, but it's, um, it smells just like a little Christmas tree. It's forest fir and they also have it in gold. So I'm gonna light it up. You guys, it's the cutest thing ever. So let me light it. Look how cute that is. Isn't that gorgeous? That is just so pretty. And then when you, of course, when the, it's not lit, the, um, the, um, lights around it goes off so let me blow it out and it goes out that's just so cute and it smells really good so it's at target you guys for ten dollars it's where the um you know where the threshold stuff is at all that kind of stuff but this is so cute i love this also you guys i wanted to sh um i had told y'all about these crab cakes i got from all these the other day I'm kind of mad, more so of myself, because on the top right here, it says made with real and imitation crab meat. So when I bought this, I must have only looked at, saw real. So, and then when you go in the back, I should have known, don't go by it, always look at the ingredients, but I didn't. I was being greedy. I probably was hungry anyway when I was in there. But anyway, right here, it says wild caught. And then on the top, it says contains bioengineered food ingredients now girl of course i'm gonna eat it because we don't throw away no food around here but i won't be buying these again and sadly they taste really good now with that being said i'm not gonna act like i i didn't eat imitation crab meat in the past because i love imitation crab meat i really really do i've had it in crab fried rice i've had it in uh crab salad that's what you make crab salad with so i love it but i'm trying to get away from stuff that's not wild caught when it comes to organic and wild caught you get what i'm saying because they they be putting all this stuff girl they're killing us slowly we won't pay attention but they're really good though but i won't be able to buy them anymore but yeah i just wanted to come back and show y'all that
So I got some of these. If you have not tried these, you gotta try them. They are so good, y'all. I got those. We got two bunches of bananas. Two bunches of bananas. I got some more apple cider vinegar. I got some more of the hot and sweet jalapenos. I love these. If you like hot and sweet, try them. They're really good. I got some mini red potatoes. I like to put these in my um uh, steak when I bake it or my chicken when I bake it. I got some chicken broth. I got some more of my bread. This bread is so good. This tortilla bread, it is so good. Got that. I got some more of the chicken fried rice. Love this stuff. I have not had it in a while, so I decided to buy three more boxes, three more bags of that. So I got three bags of this rice. And then I got some mixed vegetables for Norris. Got two bags of those. And then I got these little um chicken bread sausage patties. I was also looking for the um the uh pancake griddles. I put a picture and show y'all what I'm talking about. But they didn't have any. And he said they won't have no more in stock until January. So I think I'm gonna go to another um Trader Joe's and look for one. Then I went to Publix to get some sandwich meat because this is the only place I buy my sandwich meat. It's from the Publix Deli. And they had the brown sugar and spice ham. They had a pound for $10.99, so I grabbed these. And I like to uh, cook, make our sandwiches with, um, I usually use um, sliced turkey, but I just took the good, so I ended up getting that. So that's what I got from Trader Joe's, nothing major. Oh, I forgot to show y'all my roses. I've been buying their little small roses lately because I just love the way they look. They look so elegant. So I got these. These are, I think, $5.99, I believe, from Trader Joe's. So I got those. And then I've been hearing, hearing this lady that I follow. She talks about anthropology all the time. And I didn't know that they sold, like, all the stuff that they sell. They're, they're on the pricey side, but... Their candles, their candles, and especially like their signature candles, girl, I'm definitely going back. But anyway, I saw this when I was um, at the register, this strawberry lip balm, because I'm obsessed, obsessed with lip gloss and lip balm. I didn't need it, but I got it. And um, the lady that I follow, she was... She also purchased this cute glass. Girl, I'm so excited. She purchased this cute glass. You see that? With the little um gingerbreads. I thought that was absolutely gorgeous. So, what I plan to do is make like little cute little reels for, for in the month of December. I probably won't. I'm definitely not doing vlogmas. Because... I don't think I could hit a put out a video every every day. There's just no way. I mean, I I give it up to people who do that because that's what you call work. That's a lot of work and dedication. Anybody that can put out a vlog every day, oh my god, I have so much respect for people who do that. But anyway, um, I thought this was so pretty. They also had one with the candy cane. As well as a rainbow and all those other things. But I'm just obsessed with gingerbread. I love gingerbread. I think it's just the cutest thing ever. And this cup is so heavy, y'all. It's such great quality. The regular price, $16. I believe I paid like $10 or $11 or something like that. Still kind of pricey, but I think it's worth it. Because this glass is super heavy, y'all. Like this, this glass is so thick. It's so thick and so heavy. So I'm in love with that. The candy cane one, I almost got it. But as y'all remember, I purchased this beautiful glass. 
with the candy cane bottom from Home Goods um, about a, a couple of weeks ago. And it has the candy cane bottom, and I think that is so pretty. So, this is the difference in the two. This one was $4.99. It's gorgeous as well. But just so you'll get an idea, this is how the size is. And this one here is much bigger. As a matter of fact, this one like go inside almost. It's super huge. This is such a cute glass. I already know I'm going to use her even after Christmas. I'm not going to just use her for the holidays, baby. She's being used throughout the year for sure. But I got that, and I'm very happy about that. Anthropology is a vibe, okay? They have the cutest stuff. Pricey, but the cutest thing. So, they're definitely on my list to um, go check them out after Christmas is up. Because I noticed that they have stuff for um, in the clearance rack for things that they had for um, the fall. So, all their, like, pumpkin um vases and pumpkin mugs and all that they got all that stuff in the clearance rack so i'm sure they're gonna have christmas stuff once it's over so i'm i'm one of them people that's starting to shop a little bit after the holidays because believe it or not themselves be real sweet after the holidays so i have this and i think she's absolutely gorgeous but anyway you guys thank you so much for tuning in to my vlog i hope you enjoyed it please stop by again and see you later.